Hello, sports fans, and welcome to the Scott Sports 101 Monday Night Football Post Game Show. Well, a big win for the New York Giants tonight as they beat the San Francisco 49ers 27 to 23 at Levi's Stadium in uh, Santa Clara, California. Uh, the 49ers had a 7-3. Actually, the Giants had a 7-3 lead at the end of the first quarter, and then it was. It was a uh, 10-3 uh, Giants, and then it became uh, 10-10. Uh, it was tied at 10 for that, and then it was 13-10. It uh, uh, was 10-10 all at the half. I think it was 13-10 at the half, but then it was 20-13, to 20-10 for the Niners, and then uh, then they uh, came back. The Giants came back to and it was tied at 20 at the end of the third quarter, and and the 49ers were trying ever to score, and then it was 23 to 20. And then, and then at the last and the final two minutes, the Giants scored a touchdown uh, that sealed their victory. And it was the extra point was good, and it was 27 to 23. And and the, and Nick Mullins and the 49ers tried to score in the final seconds, but the clock had ran out, and he wanted one more. They couldn't get the pass right. The play was yeah, but the clock ran out, and he wanted one more chance, but there was no time left on the clock, and there was a flag, but the game was over. And the 49ers and the Giants get a big win, 27-23. to They go to 2-7, uh, and seven, and the 49ers fall to 2-8. and eight. Uh, Thursday uh, night football this week. Uh, actually, next Monday night, we'll have the Chiefs and the Rams next Monday night from Mexico City. Uh... The Thursday night football will be Green Bay and Seattle. I'm going to have a great Sunday night matchup. I'll let you know that uh, uh, during the week. I think it's going to be... Um, I think... Uh, I know it's going to be a good game, though. I just can't remember who it is off the top of my head, but I'll let you know. I will. Do not fret. Uh... uh and this, uh, this was a great game between the Giants and the 49ers tonight. This is one of the best games that I've seen in a long time. And and I got to give a credit to where credit is due. It's the Giants. I have to give it game ball to Giants quarterback Eli Manning. 188 yards, three touchdowns, no interceptions. I got to give one to Saquon Barkley, who uh, uh, scored a touchdown, one of the Giants' touchdowns. And I got to give one to Sterling Sharp, who also scored one of the touchdowns. So you, you guys get the game ball and. Uh, Nick Mullins was a uh, 23-62, 250 yards, one touchdown, and no interceptions. So, I just thought this was a great game between the uh, 49ers and the uh, Giants, and now Week 10 is in the books. So, so uh, uh, we'll see what happens in Week 11 this coming Sunday. So, uh, I'm trying to figure out who this... I think it's, uh, well, I'll let you know on my next broadcast. I will let you know. I will do that. Not, uh, do not worry, because I can't remember who it is off the top of my head. But this was just a, what a game tonight. And, uh, I mean, the 49ers, I know I they wanted to win this one. and But they just, they came up short in the final seconds and just couldn't get one more shot at it. They could not. And I just feel... And this was just a great game. It was just a, and this has been a whirlwind week of football in the uh, NFL this week. Uh, last Thursday night, the Steelers beat the Panthers 52 to 21 at Heinz Field. The Pittsburgh Steelers and Carolina Panthers. The Browns beat the Falcons at First Energy Stadium 28-16. The Washington Redskins beat the Tampa Bay Buccaneers 16 to 3. The Kansas City Chiefs beat the Arizona Cardinals 26-14. The Buffalo Bills beat the New York Jets 41 to 10. The Indianapolis Colts beat the Jacksonville Jaguars 29 to 26. The Chicago Bears beat the Detroit Lions 34 to 22. The New Orleans Saints wall up the Cincinnati Bengals 51 to 14. The New England Patriots beat the Tennessee Titans uh, 34 to 10. The LA Chargers beat the Oakland Raiders 20 to 6. The LA Rams beat the Seattle Seahawks 30, 36 31. The Miami Dolphins. I mean, the Green Bay Packers beat the Miami Dolphins 31-12 at Lambeau Field. And the Dallas Cowboys beat the 
I mean, the, yeah, the Dallas Cowboys beat the Philadelphia Eagles by a touchdown, 27-20, last night. And you know that the New York Giants beat the San Francisco 49ers, 27-23. And week 10 is on the books. This has been a, boy, a, just a whirlwind week of football here in the NFL. And I just feel this game was just by far just uh, an outstanding game tonight. And... Uh, I just feel uh, Pat Schumer was just coming out with some some decent plays for a change, but I still feel the Giants have been struggling. The 49ers are struggling without Jimmy Garoppolo being, with him being out for the season, but I feel Pat Schumer, I think, could be on his way out the door. I'm not sure, but we'll see. And uh, the Browns are on a bye week this week, but they will be back against Cincinnati on November 25th, the Sunday during Thanksgiving weekend. So, uh, so uh, stay tuned for that, and on uh, Thursday, September, November 22nd, tune in for a special Thanksgiving Day edition of Scott Sports 101. And I will be on location at my at the Hoyle House, home of my sister and brother-in-law, Jenny and Eric Hoyle. We'll talk NFL football, and we'll talk uh, uh, NBA basketball, college football, college basketball. <clears throat> and we'll also... <coughs> <coughs> excuse me, and we'll also... Uh, uh, and we'll talk a little baseball if we have time. And mainly we'll talk NFL football because there's three games that day. And uh, I will have two special guests on. My special guests will be my brother-in-law, Eric Hoyle, and his cousin, my cousin-in-law, Aaron Hoyle. So be sure to tune in for that because you're going to enjoy that. It's going to be a very special day, a very, very special edition on Scott Sports 101. Uh, I feel that... I mean, I really thought the 49ers were going to take this one tonight, but the Giants just came back and won it, and I just, it was an impressive win for the Giants tonight, and so I got to you got to give credit to where credit is due. So, boy, just what a game. What a game. This was a great game tonight. And so I guess that is just about going to wrap it up for the Scott Sports 101 Monday Night Football uh Post game show, and I will be back with my regular broadcast uh, tomorrow and Wednesday. And I will have the Scott Sports one on one Thursday night football pregame and post game show on Thursday uh, before the game, before the Green Bay uh, Seattle game, and after it has, the post game after it is concluded. But until then, always remember be a team player each and every day in every way possible. So long, everybody. Three, two, one, I'm done.